Hello everyone, this is Agony333, and we are in Maneater! So, last time we came into this new area, and we checked it out, we killed some things, but we are ready to completely dominate it. So, what did I do? I did as I said last time, and I went through and picked this fucker clean, did everything that I could, and unlocked the Apex. So, what are, our, what are our goals, though? Well, first, as you can see what the Apex is, it's a hammerhead shark, which is pretty fucking awesome. But yeah, we're going to go and challenge him, first thing. Then, what we're going to do is we have two more ranks to ascend in this infamy rank thing. So, we're going to basically piss off the fucking locals and challenge Pookie Paul and then Candyman Curtis. So yeah, we are going to basically kill that boss, ascend through the ranks, and take both of these fuckers out. Basically, you know, get rid of the, uh, yeah, check marks on our checklist. And, uh, see if we can also complete the other things, because it seems like we have to check on Scaly Pete after that. And I don't know what that complete boss is. Maybe that's something else. Maybe it'll be, like, you know, something, you know, an official boss battle. I don't know. We'll have to fucking see what's going on. But we're actually pretty far in the game, as you can tell. But here's another thing. So since last time, what I've also unlocked, I believe, it's been quite a long while since I've actually played the game. Unfortunately, I've been busier than motherfucker. But, I unlocked us a new ability, which is the Shadow Form. And what this does, is it says here, is it slows down the world around you, so it kind of puts the world into a slow motion kind of thing. And we move faster. It basically increases our speed, and slows everything else down, and we basically spew poison whenever we lunge. So yeah, it's very, you know, it's it's pretty damn awesome. I don't typically use abilities that much in games, but it'll be a cool addition, and it's, you know, a unique thing for us to use if we need to during, you know, a possible boss encounter or an apex attack. We'll have a special ability there to help us possibly fight through it. And as you can tell, I'm, you know, loving the shadow, uh sets here but there's something else i was going to show you guys i'm a fucking fool because watch this there's something else this the tiger body is actually dlc that i neglected to download it is for free so if anybody you know owns this game is playing this game don't be a fool like me remember it is there for you go check it out go see if you can get it the uh, tiger body and stuff because as you can see I've, I've already you know max ranked it but it gives those passive abilities it lists there, which are, it basically increases all of your intake. Which means you can pretty much get experience to level up your stuff way faster when you have that. So, even though I may not use it during these recordings, it'll be good for off-camera, you know, whenever I'm trying to, like, level up or, you know, wanting to upgrade an ability and I need some XP, I can equip this fucker and, uh, yeah, grind that shit out a lot faster. But let's actually take a look at it and see what it looks like. So that's what this bad boy looks like, which is pretty damn fucking cool, I'd say. Looks pretty damn slick, but... As I've said, you know, we don't, you know, at least I personally don't want to use the uh, tiger body during our fights, during our encounters and things. So we're going to switch it on back over to the shadow body. Keep that fucker equipped there. And make sure that we have what it takes to fucking take every m bad motherfucker on. But now that I've went through those things, and now that we've talked about what our goals are, let us go and challenge this fucking thing. How about it, guys? Are you ready for more blood and body tearing? Because, yeah, it's going to be a body harvest up in this bitch. I'm ready for it. But, God, it is cool to be back in this game. Because, yeah, it seems like it's been a fucking eternity. And, oh, shit, we have a regular hammerhead coming our way. Get him out here, here quickly. That way I can get accustomed to those controls again, because, yeah. I'm going to have to make sure I can get accustomed to those fucking controls. But I may very well use the ability just to test out and let you guys check it out. Whenever we fight this, uh, motherfucker. It also has to charge up, as you see down there. Yeah, that, uh, that orange symbol down there that's filling up. I have to charge it up to use it. So, that'll also help us here, since we're fighting this fucker. 
That'll help us charge that shit up. So yeah, as we eat, it charges that up, and then we can use it. But is there one more fucker around here? Okay, I'm hitting the wrong buttons. I was just curious if there was a, you know, small little critter for us to eat to fill this bar up. And possibly test it out whenever we go fuck this motherfucker up. Okay, so active ready. There we go. And so, let us go and... Actually, yeah, look at this thing quick. Put the hammer down. Let's track that fucker. The hammer heads wide vision range and superior depth perception are a trade-off for looking like some unholy evolutionary whore. Kill that fucking apex and we'll get a body, uh, a bone body, you know, set piece. Once we kill this fucker is what we'll get. But he's right over this way. So let's go fucking storm into his keep. Evolutionary anomaly. The Here we go, guys. Are you ready for a showdown and a throwdown? Come face me, bitch! Here's our ability. And yeah, it's, I think, a time frame. Oh, god damn it, I'm missing him. Fuck! Oh, man, he's, he's pretty tough, too. Seems like a little bit, anyways. Okay, our ability is now inactive. It helped us get about half his health down, though. Yeah, he takes a lot of hits, guys. But he's being affected by our poison right now. Which is also good. So it's putting damage on him over time. Ooh, you made me miss, did you, bitch? You're almost done for, though. The there we go. Triangle. Overcoming her opponent's clearly superior depth perception. And I'm ranked 25, guys. Hell yeah. So, we made short, quick work of this little bitch. And I made it to rank 25. And we just gotta, you know, get to that point where we can progress to Elder. Which, like I've mentioned before, I believe we have to challenge Scaly Peter. Something like that to get to that point. Marlin. Fuck you, Marlin, you fucking bitch. Anyways... Alright, so we have taken care of him. So now let's go up to the top surface and engage with the humans. And break the waters! Yeah, this is a really cool area. As you can see, there's like a kind of... Not really carnival thing, but yeah, you know, sort of like that. And there's like... I don't know about this area over here. But it seems pretty like... I'm almost wondering if you can kind of go into this place at some point. Let me see if I can show you what I mean here. Well, yeah, I mean, you can obviously go in there once you're an elder, but if you look over here, watch, I'll show you this quick, guys. I thought this was pretty damn strange. Like, I'm curious what the fuck's over here. I'll show you what I mean. But as you see, look at this big fucking thing. Huge ass, you know, fake shark. Yeah, look at that. That looks... Pretty fucking crazy to me, like something bad is in there. Because yeah, the uh, grate l goes into that building. Whatever this big, massive fucking building is. Which is kind of, has kind of like a doomish kind of vibe to it. As you can tell from that statue. There's a big building and that grate will go in there. So once we're an elder, we'll have to bust in there and see what the fuck that's all about. It kind of gives me the impression like it's an arena or something, you know, like wouldn't say a stadium, but I mean, looks like a big, big kind of battle arena or something. I don't know, but maybe I'm fucking wrong entirely, but let us start targeting fuckers. Because, yeah, we want to, I'm making sure not to go outside of, because, yeah, we if we get this stuff done quick enough, we may as also come over here, which is the Gulf, which I really want to see the Gulf. We'll go from, yeah, Sapphire Bay over into the Gulf. And see about this area, possibly. Let's start chomping down, bitches. Get that threat level up. Make them see who the threat of the oceans are. Well, is, yes. What the threat of the ocean is. It's us. Be afraid. Be very afraid. But yeah, anyways, another thing I was going to say, guys, is uh, we're about to already trigger that shit. I have not played Doom Eternal, but I've been listening to the soundtracks. With the hunters in pursuit of a dangerous and here he shark, comes. Those closest to him, prepare for the possibility that they might come home. 
But yeah, the only thing they fear is you. Awesome fucking song from Doom Eternal. I recommend checking that fucking bad bitch of a soundtrack out. Well, that song out. So there's Hunter's staff, but... I don't think, uh, Pookie Paul or whatever is over here yet. Unless I'm just missing him. I don't know. These look like regular hunters to me. So let's fucking dispatch these bitches until Pookie bitch comes out. Actually, I just realized, yeah, we have to actually ascend a higher rank than this. We have to be rank 3, I think, to bring him out, so... So there we go, we blew that up. Fucking take care of more of them. Come on, Pookie! Oh my god, yes. Another thing I should mention is, uh... During my, uh, playthrough... My time, you know, outside of this... When I've been doing shit... I took on not, uh, like, a huge, huge ship, but, uh... Much bigger ship than... I think we have faced previously. Yeah, as you can tell... They're not even putting a dent in us now. Whereas before, they were kind of menacing. We were just destroying these boats. We were fucking just tearing these guys to bits. We're going to fill this goddamn bar up. And see what uh, ability we get from Pookie. About three-fourths of the way. Come on. There we go. Send more. Kind of like, you know, um, Return of the Living Dead. More brains. The shark hunters have arrived. Soon we will see them in action and quite possibly discover which one of them stole my car steering. More food. Bring us more. All right. There we go. They may as well just run the fuck away, but I guess these assholes just never learn, do they? Yeah, they see a gigantical fucking tyrant in the water and they gotta try to face off. Get fucking killed in the process like nothing. We'll have to see if Pookie Paul is more of a challenge than these assholes are. Here he comes. Pookie Paul is hunting you. The savage shrimp. Pookie Paul. I'm gonna take that fucking guitar and shove it up your ass, Pookie. You little bitch. Okay, he's doing a little bit more. Smash this shit quickly. Come on there. Oh, he's almost got us halfway down, guys. So, yeah, he is definitely more challenging than... We may have to die for water. Okay, wait. I killed him. The shark's reckless behavior Mineral digestion. Whatever ability that was, we got it. Mineral digestion. But we're not done yet, guys. We're not done... <clears throat> We're gonna go to rank four. Fuck it. I'm not gonna screw around. Let's just keep on tormenting. Ooh, that fucker went flying. Did you see that? Yes. There we go. Holy shit. Is he throwing fucking grenades? So yeah, as you can tell, even the regular hunters are getting way crazier. That's dynamite. They're throwing fucking sticks of dynamite at us, guys. So yeah, they're getting worse. They're getting way deadlier. So yeah, as we increase the infamy rank, we're not just facing off against harder bounty hunters, but the actual normal forces escalate as well, which is pretty crazy. So the challenge will sort of be there. We'll see some more bullshit. So far, still have not died in the game yet, though, so... We'll see if I can keep that up. And actually, I'm kind of wondering, um... I can't do that now, I'll do that later. Okay, I was... I was thinking about that damn license plate over there. I think I've already tried it and it was a bitch or something. Yeah, certain ones I'm still holding off on to do later on on my own. But we're almost halfway there to the next rank. Now I'm kind of wondering if that ability works up here. Okay, it does. They're in slow motion up here, too. Yeah, even though they're above the waters, it's still slow motion. Which is also useful. Because it works on these fuckheads. Oh, yeah. I love the carnage. 
Oh, come on. Damn it, bitch. We're almost there. Blow up those fucking shits. But I'm wondering how that Candyman guy is going to be. And that actually also brings another uh, talking point around. I'm excited for the new Candyman movie, guys. I'm excited to see that because I bet it's going to be really fucking good. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, let's, let's get underwater, guys. Let's get underwater and heal up. We have to. I'm sorry, but I don't want to chance it. So let's chomp on the seal quickly. Yeah, I'm totally gonna, when I get the chance, go, uh... Oh, god damn it, bitch! Get over here, you little fucker! Get down here! Hey! Don't you run from me! Okay, we ate him, let's... Oh, god damn it. They're gonna start shooting again. But, um... Yeah, hopefully I get the chance to go to the theater and see that, because I would love to see Candyman. I'm happy that they got Tony Todd still in the role. Because, yeah, I love when movies keep the original, you know, cast members and stuff. Let's get up there before they give up on the search. And let's keep it going. Come on. We're almost there. We will make it. Beat this guy while we're here. Get that health back and smash another fucking ship. Come on! Candyman ain't gonna fucking do anything to me. Hey, Candyman is a badass fucker, but do you guys really think he could take on a big menacing shark like this? I don't know, man. He might he might meet his match. There we go. Plenty of grub for us to eat out here. Come on. Die already, god damn it. There we go. Eat. Consume. Eat. Consume. The shark, perhaps having gone too far with her pranks and hijinks, is now the subject of a countywide pranks shark and hunt. pranks and hijinks. This is way more sinister than that shit, dude. I don't know what the hell he's talking about. This goes beyond pranks and hijinks, dude. We were just knocking that boat back without hardly even trying. That boat is just being knocked. Holy fuck! And we still got, yeah, I'm pretty sure, like, you know, levels to ascend to and maybe mass to uh, gain. Uh-oh. Gotta watch out for the dynamite. Okay, Candyman Curtis is coming. Oh, don't sit still, damn it. There he is. Candyman Curtis. Where's his hook? Oh. oh, he's got a fucking automatic weapon, though, guys. We're halfway dead. God damn it, I wanted that turtle. Turtle stew! Now it's reminding me of the turtles from uh, the forest, everybody. I'm sorry, guys, but I needed to eat. I had to do it. But all right, where's Candyman? You're fucking going down. Oh my god. Where is this asshole at? I don't know which boat he's on. Oh my god, okay. So yeah, they're, they're having way more firepower, guys. There he is. He's on this boat. Use our ability. So I might end up using our abilities more than I was mentioning, because... Wait, was he on that boat? I thought he was on that boat. Or is he on this boat? Okay, he's on this boat. Because, yeah, um, since the challenge is going to go up, I'm going to use that ability to save our asses here. Come on, we got him. Come on, we almost have this bitch. Oh my god, I gotta dive down, guys. Sorry. No, get down, dipshit. Get down. What are you doing? Oh my god, we got him. We got him. Increased aerial surveillance, confidence amongst tourists and locals oh my god. is far from buoyant. Yeah, reason I freaked out was because, uh... Yeah. We were getting pretty close there. And we ranked up to level 26 now. We just managed to take him out before coming down here, though. Oh god, no. Come on, Marlin, quit fucking with me. I'm, yeah, sorry guys, the uh, controls are... I'm still trying to reacquaint myself, and that was not the time to forget the controls, because we could have fucking bit the bullet there and died. God damn it, Marlin, fuck off. Humans' attention spans are short. 
They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so thus ends the bounty. Okay, have a look at Pete's latest undertaking. So Pete's up to something, is what it seems like, guys. He is totally up to some kind of BS here. So, yeah, personal project. Pete's got some top secret project under a tarp. And you've got to admit, you're at least a little bit curious. So, yeah, something's going on. So we're going to go fucking find out what that is. Let's go fucking do that right now. God damn, they're getting fucking ruthless up there, though. So we're going to have to really watch ourselves and start, like I said, using that ability. Let's run over here as quickly as we can, as our body can take us. We're going to ignore these fucking fish. And I'm wondering now if there's going to be a boss encounter. That's what I'm wondering, because... I mean, that check thing says boss. Let's see. Yeah, zero out of one boss, so are we going to fight something under this tarp? What the hell is it? What's it going to be? I'm so... In wonderment here. What you got for me, Scaly? What you got for me? It's been a while since we met your stupid ass. Let's go. But are you guys curious as well? Just like, you know, our little shark. Just like me. Oh, it does not matter what it will be. We're going to tear it bit by bit, regardless. Whenever that fucker shows itself anyways. But yes, still enjoying the game. Highly recommending it. That makes me autic by you. As twilight falls, Pete is in an uncharacteristically quiet mood. Something's up for sure. It's a dangerous job. It's not something unknown to me. Well, you want to see dangerous? Look at that, yeah? That's PT-522. My daddy crewed that off of Guadalcanal. He was Navy. Gunner's mate. Pacific Theater. But when I was 16 men, came back a day later with three. Man survives all that. Just to die here in the Gulf. What happened to him? Oh, you don't like me saying this. But my daddy, his granddaddy, was killed by a mega shark. I, I, I'm sorry. He's talking about a prehistoric fish that went extinct 2.6 million years ago. I seen it. Now, you were a kid. Ain't they discovering new animals all the time? Sort of. Well, not, not exactly. In lots of cases, they're just corrections of species with different names. Also stuff like misspelling. But, I just say it. Maybe there are things in the water that ain't in your textbook. Stick around. Maybe you learn a thing or two this summer. Whatever. The ocean is vast. The majority of it still remains unmapped and unexplored by mankind. Perhaps Kyle shouldn't be so quick to dismiss his father's fevered ramblings. So, his father, Scaly Pete, is talking about a Megalodon, which is a fucking fearsome, uh, a fearsome idea, a fearsome prospect, to say the least. Let's just say it's a very, very massive shark for anybody who does not know what a Megalodon is. So, challenge Pete and Kyle. Pete the Revenge. Scaly Pete is nearby. So, guys. It is indeed time. Pete the Revenge. Pete killed your mother. What more motivation do you need? So, it's time, guys. We're gonna challenge Pete and Kyle. And you know what? How about let's just go fucking do it. Well, one sec, one sec. Let's check out our new ability and just look at it anyways. Because remember, we got a couple new things here, I think. What is it? Let me see. Okay, mineral digestion increases how many minerals you gain and health you heal by feeding. So that's not bad. That'll help us get minerals and then more health. And adrenal gland. That on low health, our speed and everything pretty much increases. Pretty good, but I like what we've already got. So, and actually, let me see here. Didn't we get a bone thing? Okay, bone body is what we got. Okay, okay. So, Bone Crusher ability. 
Bone Crusher turns you into a bone battering ram, allowing you to shatter boats like glass. So that one will be good for when we fight ships. So I may want to upgrade that and use that. I won't do that at this moment. But yeah, I figured it was cool to check those out very fast. But over here... Oh, god damn it. Wrong button. Fuck, fuck off with your buttons, damn it. Alright. Over here is Scaly Pete. So let's go fucking meet his ass. I'm curious to see if... I don't think we'd end up killing him already. Well, actually, let me do one thing quick. Okay, so circle does that. What the hell? Okay, so square was the button I was trying to find earlier. Let's do this quickly. There's a reason, though. I want to have our ability up. There we go. Okay, our ability's up. Let's go. Let's just go and fucking do this now. I'm ready. I've been waiting for this fight. Yeah, I don't think we're going to finish off Scaly Pete just now. It seems, you know what I mean? He seems like a kind of guy that's going to stick around for most, if not all, the game, I would say. But let's go, Scaly. Be afraid. That's the one what took my hand, all right. Get yourself ready, boy. Oh, you will not be ready enough. You will not be prepared for what I will cause. Okay. Watch out for that fucking dynamite. We may have to break away, guys, at some point. Oh my god, yeah. He's he's hitting hard. Okay, I'm gonna have to get the hell down. I gotta go get food, guys, right now. Get at him, divers. Reason is, because, yeah, I'm not chancing that crap. No, fuck off, bitch. There we go. I did not come this far to fuck up on you. Let's grab that turtle and get up there. Fucking divers down here? Okay, where is he at up here? Get him over there? What? Oh my god, come on. Yes, that's them. Come on! Okay, cage is down. Reinforcements incoming. Okay, they're... Yeah, there's gonna be even worse shit. Using the ability, guys. Let's get it. I'm just chomping at this damn boat. There we go. We did it. So, what's going to be the fate of this? You know, is their ship fucked and they're going to get away? Or are we going to finish off the job? Are we going to finally eat Scaly Pete? Or his son? Scaly Pete remains resolute. Where's she at? I don't know. Ah! Oh shit. Now, Holy fuck. Can! Get that can! Down, sir! Pique it to walk! Oh shit. We're about to blow! Get the f off! Forget it, boss! He's just a boy! Oh shit. <coughs> Holy fuck. What remains of the boat lurches, then slowly sinks to the bottom of the sea. So holy shit, guys. I was gonna say, did we get rid of Kyle? But it said, where's Kyle? So we don't know. The shark is now an elder, and thus begins a new battle against systemic age discrimination. But yeah, guys, we are now an elder shark. And our breech lunge has increased, our air lunge, our lung capacity, all that has been up. Look at that, how beastly we are now. We are fucking killer. Truly a killer. Okay. So yeah, we don't know what happened to Kyle. We don't know whether he got killed or if he'll come back later on. 
And man, did we fuck up Scaly P. Did you see? He, now he's lost a leg. And he's burnt to, to a fucking crisp. So he is going to be incredibly fucking pissed. But I don't want to end this just yet. You know why, guys? Let's, let's actually see. Because we're on to the next chapter. I want to see a little bit more here. I'm a cave for you. So find all. We're not going to the Gulf, guys. We're going to Prosperity Sands. Which is still cool because it's a new area. And I'm curious about that one as well. So we're going to go to Prosperity Sands. And there's an Apex there. And obviously Scaly P is still alive. But let's go over there. I want to check out that new area. So we're going to be going over here to Prosperity Sands. Let's fucking go. Let's go get this shit. Go check it out and see its grotto and stuff. Because, yeah, I feel like that would be, you know, something neat. I mean, we had pretty epic moments here. Pretty big, you know, moments in the storyline anyways. That was pretty fucking intense and crazy. But I want us to see something new here also. A new area. Look how fucking big we are. Because, yeah, we've increased in size, guys. That's for sure. Okay, let me see. I have to go around, don't I? Wait a minute. Do I go around this way, or... Or is the fence there? Wait, I don't know. I've never really went over there. So I'm gonna have to look, guys. I'm gonna have to look very quickly. Because we might actually have to go back and go around. In order to fucking see this new area. Because I know they're over that way. On that side of the, uh... Waters, there's like a big kind of fence line that's keeping us from leaving. And I stayed away from this one because I didn't want to spoil anything. So yeah, we're coming up on it. We should be anyways. Let me go around this way. And see. Okay, so yeah, we're totally seeing it. God, that's freaky. Look how open that is. Because yeah, that is the gulf. But we're going to go up in here to Prosperity Sands. Even if this is the gulf and shit, we're gonna go up to Prosperity Sands. Okay, so it's loading it in. It's so loading it in, and even though I want to see the gulf, I'm gonna stay out of... The ocean is a source of life, inspiration, and eternal renewal. But mostly it exists to be exploited and commodified. Bitch! I am 26 Elder, fuck off! Anyways, yes. So we enter the gulf, but I'm gonna not- I'm gonna save that, guys, till it's our time to enter this area officially. But we did that to cross on over, because here we're going. Actually, it's quite a ways away, but... Gosh, this is exciting as hell to see this new place. Prosperity and here we are. Sands features glittering white beaches, faced off for the sole enjoyment of the ultra-rich, mega-rich, and super-rich. So, as you can tell... From what it was saying there. Oh, wrong button again. Don't worry, guys. I'll leave you alive for a moment. Uh, yeah, as you guys can tell. It's gonna be a lot of, you know, beaches and stuff. Is this area? Here's a landmark. This trimaran, like many before it, was lost in its journey to the mythological dry land. Nice. I figured we'd nab that and check that out along the way. Yeah, so this is going to be more of, like, beaches, stuff like that, beachgoers, sunbathers, more snack foods for us. But I wonder what the apex of this area is going to be. What is that? Mahi Mani? I don't know. I'm, a, I'm an idiot, guys. I'm sorry. I mean, I don't know much about my fish. But okay, it's over this way. Yep, more and more nice, beautiful beaches. If only they knew what was lurking, what was coming. Because the peace will be shattered. Yep, pretty nice fucking sights here. We're we'll to see how cool this fucking grotto looks. And we are right up on this bitch, right about over here. And there it's we are. Here in the, grotto that the shark can discover the absolute serenity deep within her soul. Kind of like a sewer grotto. Okay, we can't go down, but yeah, kind of like a little, you know, 
little tiny sewage place. Wait, what's this up here? Okay, so there ain't really much up here. But there's our pretty little grotto. You know, no giant ships or anything, but it's a nice little, you know, a nice little home regardless. But what am I going to do, guys? Well, I'm going to do just like I have before. I'm going to pretty much go through and clear out, you know, the revenge, clear out the hunt, the population control, all my own. Pretty much, you know, go through the entire map, try to get all those side things, clear it all out, and I will bring us back. I will bring us back whenever we are ready to take on that next apex. And then check on Scaly Peak, because it does not look like we're going to have to uh, increase our infamy just yet. But yeah, we will have a new apex, a new mystery apex to see in this area. And then we're going to see how Scaly P is doing in the aftermath of that insane clash that we just had with him. Which was pretty damn awesome, I'd say. But, remember guys, if you like Maneater, like, comment, subscribe for more of it. And see how this, you know, this, this climactic fight and showdown will end at some point. Because we're getting further and further along. We're about, I think, almost three-fourths of the way. Because we're almost, you know, 70%. It's almost 75%. But like, comment, subscribe to see more of it. Because it's going to get fucking awesome up in here. And also remember to like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more horror as well. Because that will be coming in abundance. And I hope you're all having a great, wonderful, amazing fucking day. And this is Agony333 signing out. Have a great one, folks. Peace.